10 Weirdest Schools You Won't Believe Exist Education, to most of us anyway, is important as it helps us develop our ability to reason. But before we say more and ruin it for you, here are 10 strangely unique schools you won't believe exist. Number 10. Tiny Tits School even though nothing's really weird when it comes to this school's agenda or nature, its name gives it a naughty character. Wouldn't you feel strange saying you graduated from Tiny Tits School? Come on, be honest. Number 9. Hamburger University Hamburger University was founded in 1961 by Ray Kroc to teach the secrets of McDonald's to eager minds. The first university is located in Oak Brook, Illinois, a western suburb of Chicago, but it has since spread to Tokyo, London, Sydney, and Shanghai. And before you laugh about the whole thing, keep in mind that getting into Harvard is currently easier than in McDonald's University in China, since less than 1% of the applicants will eventually be accepted there. Number 8. Gulu Elementary School Gulu is a remote Chinese mountain village located in a national park filled with canyons, precipices, and overhanging rocks. The village's primary school is probably the most remote in the world. Lying halfway up a mountain, it takes five hours to climb from the base to the school. Number 7. Burgess Hill School This experimental UK-based school that was founded back in the rebellious 60s, definitely deserves a mention since it was one of the most progressive schools worldwide, especially if one takes into account how strict British life was back then. The school allowed its students to do pretty much whatever they wanted. Fancy a cigarette during class? No problem. Plow through the school grounds on a motorbike? Ditto. Number six, Brooklyn Free School. Brooklyn Free School's mission is education geared towards social justice. It engages students and staff in democratic decision-making and problem-solving. The school has no grades, no tests, and no compulsory classes or homework. Furthermore, students are free to leave classes as they please. Number 5. Walt Disney Elementary in the mid-1950s, some children, who apparently loved Disney films way too much, at the public elementary school in Levittown, Pennsylvania, were given the opportunity to name their school after a public figure. When Disney found out about this honor, he decided to send artists to decorate the school. Half a century later, the school is still all things Disney, with classrooms and hallways devoted to Disney characters. Number 4. School of the Future the Philadelphia School of the Future aims to explore ways to better prepare students for success in our digital world and global economy. They accomplish this by foregoing textbooks and instead applying technological tools such as computers for students, OneNote for note-taking, and computerized smart boards for teachers. They even have digital lockers that use a student's IDs card as a key. Number 3. Which School? Which School is a Wiccan school offering both online courses as well as courses on their two campuses in Chicago, Illinois and Salem, Massachusetts. As the name suggests, this is a place where witchcraft is taught. Number 2. Delphian School Delphian was founded in the 1970s by a group of educators who shared a dream of transforming education. It is an independent, co-educational day and boarding school located in Sheridan, Oregon, and is open to students from around the world. Inside the secretive and very expensive Scientology school, students are taught through clay modeling and staring matches, while some of the most famous celebrities such as Tom Cruise and Nicole Kidman have trusted their kids' education to it. Number 1. Trabajo Ya School. This is literally a school like no other, one that offers professional instruction in how to sell your body. For about 100 fee, pupils at Trabajo Ya, which means work now, in Valencia, Spain, are offered a basic course in professional prostitution with maximum discretion. However, Spain's first prostitution school still faces legal challenges from campaigners seeking to close it amid growing public concern.